Hello everyone and welcome to Javelin Technologies video on the interoperability of SOLIDWORKS Desktop and SOLIDWORKS Industrial Designer. As a great deal of complex freeform shapes are created around existing mechanical or electronic components, it may be important to start an industrial design around geometry from SOLIDWORKS. This can be done by hovering over the plus icon and selecting Import, SOLIDWORKS. Find your object and select OK. Once it is imported, you can use that as a reference for the object that you'll be creating. Once you imported your object, go into the Assembly tab and click Insert New Component. This will essentially transform your part into an assembly and create a new part that is ready for editing. You can work with the part in this mode or you can open it up individually if you prefer by selecting Open Component from the right-click menu. Once your component's shape is defined using SOLIDWORKS Industrial Designer, you likely want it back in SOLIDWORKS to complete your design. To do this, make sure you save file, then go to the share icon and hit export. When exporting, choose the file format SLD XML. In SOLIDWORKS Desktop, open the file from where it had been saved. You may receive this pop-up asking you if you would like to run imported diagnostics on the part to determine if there are any errors with the freeform object. If there are any errors, you can click the faulty face on the left to highlight it, then click attempt to heal all. In some cases, if you did not properly create the object in industrial design, you may be forced to return and spend some time editing the area to ensure that it is made correctly. Now you can edit the part some more in SOLIDWORKS, or you can import it into your assembly and continue working. If design changes to the underlying shape are required, it is best to edit the component in SOLIDWORKS Industrial Designer, repeat the export procedure and edit the imported feature in the SOLIDWORKS model to base it on a new SLD XML file. Thank you for watching this video on the interoperability of SOLIDWORKS and industrial design. If you are interested in trying out industrial design, click the I at the top right of this video and follow the link to Javelin's webpage. Once you fill out the required information at the bottom, a representative from Javelin will contact you as soon as they are available. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful, comment if you have any questions, and subscribe for more awesome industrial design content. Thank you.